breastfeeding versus formula feeding exploring the pros and cons hello everyone and welcome back to our channel my mom's choice today we are tackling a topic that's near and dear to the hearts of parents everywhere breastfeeding versus formula feeding it's a decision that many parents grapple with and we are here to provide you with a thorough exploration of the pros and cons associated with both approaches so let's jump right in breastfeeding a natural and time honored practice offers a multitude of benefits to both the baby and the mother it provides essential nutrients and antibodies that boost the baby's immune system aiding in the prevention of illnesses Furthermore, the bonding experience between mother and child during breastfeeding is unparalleled, creating a strong emotional connection. On the other hand, formula feeding provides convenience and flexibility, allowing multiple caregivers to share feeding responsibilities. It's a viable option for mothers who may face challenges with breastfeeding or those who choose to return to work sooner. Now that we have covered some of the advantages of both breastfeeding and formula feeding, let's delve deeper into the potential drawbacks. Breastfeeding, while beneficial, can sometimes be physically demanding and time-consuming. New mothers may experience discomfort, and the process requires a substantial time commitment. Additionally, some mothers may struggle with latching issues or milk supply. Formula feeding, while convenient, comes with financial costs and preparation hassles. The expense of formula and feeding equipment can add up over time. Moreover, formula-fed babies may miss out on some of the immune-boosting properties and unique bonding experiences that breastfeeding offers. It's clear that both breastfeeding and formula feeding have their own set of pros and cons. Ultimately, the choice between the two depends on individual circumstances, preferences, and the well-being of the baby. Thank you for joining us today as we explored the world of breastfeeding versus formula feeding. Remember, there is no one-size-fits-all answer, and the most important thing is to prioritize your baby's health and well-being. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, subscribe to our channel for more informative content, and hit that notification bell so you never miss an update. Until next time, take care and happy parenting.